Hello and welcome to episode 13 of Having Fun Playing Alan Wake! Woo! So, I might find Alice this episode. I'm looking forward to that. Also, look! There's a tree from my car. That's a nice glitch. Trees going through the car. I'm glad those aren't taken by the darkness. Woo! Let's go. Okay, um, Bright Falls Coal Mine. Ah, shit. I can do this. I was early. I was supposed to meet the kidnapper at noon in the main building. The coal mine was quiet. It was a museum now. It's a cool museum. I guess. Do we have gold here? Does this say anything? While Luke Triff at first, the mining steadily declined in the 20th century. The scenes were which were rich but hard to get at. To go get at. I'm reading so badly. The volcanic activity in the area made the mine shaft particularly dangerous. Wait, volcanic activities? Why did no one tell me about that? Oh, Thermo. Lots of coffee, Mr. Wake. You need it. It's funny. I have picked up 28 or 29 thermos, but still you haven't drink a sing single cup. Oh, another manuscript page. Sarah on the radio station. With Nightingale gone and the night wind blowing in through the broken studio window, Maine stared at Sarah. The sheriff looked away. Maine's voice shook with barely controlled anger. That boy's doing more drinking than thinking. I hope you know what you're doing, Sarah. He's got a sickness in his eyes. You take my word for it. He wants Wake for a reason, and it's not for anything good. He wants to kill me. In 1970, a volcanic eruption below Cauldron Colin Rake, while relatively minor, caused most of the deep mine tunnels to f collapse or flood. Thirty miners lost their lives in the calamity, and all mining around Bright Falls came to a final stop. Now many of the many of the remaining buildings are protected as a historical landmark. I am so bad at reading English today. I don't know why. Whoa! <laughs> cool. I didn't want to go outside. The cops had to be looking for me. Yep. The noon sun turned the place into a sauna. The day dragged on. Different scenarios ran through my mind. Ways of how I'd torture the kidnapper to get Alice back. Or the different horrible things he could have done to her. I imagined her dead. I had no way of knowing she was still alive. It was killing me. Oh, don't tell me it's gonna be... Blind hope. It was all a waste of time. The bastard never showed up. It's a trap. He waited for darkness to fall. So I can easily kill you. Bastard. As yes, you put it yourself. Wake! Where the hell are you? Change of plans. You know where Mirror Peak is? It's a big mountain north of where you are. You follow the path from the mine, you can't miss it. There's a lookout point there. I'll be waiting. I'm through being jerked around you by you. You want to see your wife alive? Because if you do, you better watch what you say to me. Do we understand each other? I want to talk to Alice. Yeah, and I want the manuscript. Don't keep me waiting, Wake. Hello? Hello? Ah! I'm going to kill him. I can imagine. I had to get to Mirror Peak. How do I get off here? Whoa! Shit. shit! 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 No! 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 It was close. Maybe closer than ever before. Let me get out. I'm gonna hold on to my flash. I'm kind of scared. Of what's gonna happen? Why can't I get out? Can I? Oh, okay. I can jump down here. Why couldn't I get out? The way I get in. That seems so weird. Flash and batteries. I'm all up. Batteries. Oh, a secret exit. 
don't give me this much stuff. Oh, Thermo. This looks like a boss fight incoming. Oh, ow. I wasn't intending to do that. Okay, this doesn't look safe at all. I'm just gonna read this page. When Thomas Zane fell for Barbara Jagger, it happened fast. She was young, vibrant and beautiful, full of life. He had never been a very happy man, and without any seeming effort, she had changed all that. Zane felt good for the first time in his life. Everything she did was another piece of a jigsaw puzzle he hadn't even known he'd been missing. And best of all, she made the words flow, strong and sharp. She was his muse. Interesting. But... I'm not gonna run that while evil things out to kill me. Another revolver? Okay. An infinite ammo stock. Ow. Pick up some other ammo and put a flat down here just to get you guys out of my face. What? Oh, that worked. Huh. I didn't imagine that would work. Whoa! What was that? Oh, it's alive, it's alive, it's alive, it's alive. Oh, no, 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 no. Phew. Can I recover some health anywhere? Jeez. Things are out to kill me. Oh, no, no, no. Phew. Okay, I'm gonna use my batteries up pretty quickly like this. Oh, thank god. Flashbangs. They're bound to five. Okay. I don't know if, it, if anything's behind me, but I'm just gonna use this one to get. Six conscribe. There wasn't anything behind me. Uh, this one's gonna lift up, I think. Looks almost too obvious. I knew it. What the hell is this? I think I'm just gonna climb this. lie on this just to kill it. I don't think that was all. Oh no, it wasn't. What the hell is that in there? It is just a box, but damn it looks evil. Oh no 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 Don't let me don't it ow God, this place is getting harder and harder to get through. Maybe I should just wait and recover some health before going on. I bet that would be a good idea. Oh, no, no. Okay. I don't even want to know what that is. That looks dangerous. The only way to reach the hillside ahead was to go through the building. I had to find a way to avoid electrocution. Um, I think I'm just going to explore this area here. 
That seems like a good idea. Oh no, it doesn't, but... Oh yeah. I think I'm gonna... Whoa! There, okay. Maybe I should actually use the car here. But I just don't want to wreck it if I'm actually gonna use it for something. Oh uh, no, my own just gonna take it. Maybe I could drive it up there. Well, let's try. I mean, a car is not that easy to electrocute, considering got rubber tires and such. Let's see. Oh, I can actually drive this one. No, that's damaging it. For some reason. Okay, let's get out of here. I can be that way. I think they intended for me to actually use the car to kill all of all those. I guess I'm just too badass for that. I don't. <laughs> Why did I just say that? I'm gonna get home for something. So screwed. This looks like such a bad idea to do. Of course it was. I'm just gonna get into this car. Whoa! This car doesn't so sound right at all. Whoa, 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 no, no, no. This car is impossible to drive in this weather. Die. Die. I'm so scared they're gonna wreck this car. Okay, it is wrecked. I mean, I'm just gonna use it for surviving. Come on, come on, come on. Whoa, okay. Huh. Worked like a charm. This is working way too good. There, and that was the last one. That. <laughs> it's completely broken. Thank you, car. I'll miss you. You are a lifesaver. Of sorts. I'm not going to do that stupid move I did last time. I'm gonna use a flan that. That's a little less overkill. Oh, I don't like this place at all. It's way too quiet. Yep, it is! Reload, 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 reload. There, that one fine. I think I should use the jet gun for that one. Or those. I mean, they were close enough. Okay. Oh! 
more stuff. They really like giving me new stuff to kill things with. That just seems so... Uh, okay. Where am I gonna get attacked from? Way too easy. Trust no one in the dark. Yeah, I know. Wonder what Nithingale. I mean, I've only met him in the dark. Maybe he's different in the light. Maybe everyone's different in the light. They're only like this when it's dark. Follow. Thank you. Strange yellow Some text on the wall. The echoes of their former selves, but these were just the nerve twitches of a dead thing. Nothing remained but a shell covered and filled with darkness. In most cases, these puppets were enough for the purposes of the dark presence. But for anything more elaborate, as with the writer, it was different. It needed his mind, and so rather than taking him over completely, it merely touched him. That sounds scary. Like, really scary. Oh, don't make me jump again. There's something... Something's gonna come after me as soon as I take another step. Whoa! Um, hello? I'm just gonna use this fuse box. Okay, no, I'm not. Is that flashbangs? Yep, that's there flashbangs. No way the flashbang grenades were standard power company equipment. I believe you. Oh. I need this. Nope. Huh, can I jump through here? I'm not sure. I don't think I can. Oh, I can see you guys. Um, I'm just gonna search this area instead because I really don't like this place. Oh, well, I guess I'll have to face my... Oh! Nope. I'm not gonna face you. You're gonna face me. That was so bad. There. Anyone else want some? I got plenty of bullets and plenty of batteries. Yep. Okay, maybe I'll revise that. Yep. Maybe I really should take and revise that. Oh shit, this can hold a lot of batteries. Okay, got you. I think I'm gonna use the flashbang grenades and just save the flag on the flag. It's pretty good at aiming. Things I want dead. Uh, okay. Holy shit, it uses an entire flashlight. God, yeah. This is a little easier. Where am I headed? That's to Mirror Peak lookout, but... Wait, weren't I in Mi Mirror Peak earlier? I don't know. Oh, anyways. Magical page. 
I stared through the bars of the jail cell. Barry stood behind me, swaying on his feet, looking as ill as I felt. Agent Nightingale stood on the other side of the bars with Sheriff Breaker. Nightingale had a stack of manuscript pages in his hand. He seemed unhinged as he gloated. Well, I've got you now, Raymond Chandler. It's all here. All the evidence, including conspiracy to murder a federal agent. What? Uh, hey, another name for me. Anyways, guys, I'm going to call this an episode. I'm... I didn't get to find Alice. I'm actually kind of sad about that. I'd hope the kidnapper would have kept his word and be there. But hey, he's a kidnapper, so you never know. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Have fun till last... next time. The poet came down to the lake to call to his dear. When there was no answer, he was all.